worth more than a thousand slaves to the right hands. Whose hands? The Emperor of China. She was commissioned to replace his daughter, died of a fever some 20 years ago. She is a spitting image of the girl. What's an android? A machine. Made to look and act like a man or a woman in this case. Wait, you're telling me that that's a machine? Uh, Lacassant's finest work. Left incomplete when he died, but King Louis' engineers took over the project until the revolution. Then Napoleon took it over. It was Napoleon who promised the emperor that he would bestow on the android the likeness of his child. I was ordered to deliver her. You chose to go by land? Not the I. Uh, hey there! Are you really a machine? <laughs> Doesn't she speak? Oh, she is broken. Broken? Uh, a broken machine is one that ignores your commands and goes right on doing whatever it feels like. Has a mind of her own, huh? I assure you, she does not have any sort of mind. She is malfunctioning. <laughs> she seems to have a mind to me. Ah, raw matter. It cannot possess a soul. Then why does she behave like that? Ah, because she was programmed in part by wistful idiots. She only does what she was built to do? <coughs> oh, until recently. When she stopped obeying my commands. It started when we boarded our ship. Uh, she wouldn't get on. I'm terrified of the water, she said. And so I am. As though a machine could know fear. Oh, let's walk, she said. And so I did. And I have been chasing her ever since. Oh, why don't you just leave her and go back home? What, did I have my head cut off? Besides, a king's reward awaits me when I deliver her to the east. It's just incredible. Ah, it could be the wave of the future, once we've learned to keep them from breaking. <laughs> How does she work? Her mind is a complex of tiny pieces that exist either in an on or off state. Her behavior follows from the patterns of the on and offs at any point in time. But she reacts to the world. Uh, she interprets what she sees as numbers. The numbers start to chain reaction in the tiny pieces in her mind, altering the patterns. Consequently, her behavior. The changes fool you into thinking she is aware. She seems so real. <laughs> she is raw matter, my friend. And as we all know, spirit cannot arise from raw matter. Nor the mind from the body. No, the soul controls the body, not the other way around. I don't believe in ghosts. <laughs> spirit. What's that, Mazu? She has to have spirit. How else would I be in love with her? You can't. <laughs> You're not. I am. I do. What? I do have a spirit. Or a mind, rather. So far as minds go, anyway, I reached the end of mine long before I could think. That is, until I realized that minds as such do not actually exist. <laughs> you just think they don't exist because you have never experienced having one. <laughs> this old goat has never said a word of truth to me as long as I've known him. That's why I don't run away. He's teaching me to lie. <laughs> <laughs>